So a lot of folks have questions about the auto choke setup on a Briggs & Stratton engine. You can see it right here. Uh, the important things with this system, it rarely goes bad. Uh, but one thing that happens is people lose this spring here. And you can see it attaches to this little tin uh, cover and then it attaches to the arm right here. And then you go over to this side here and this is the little actuator arm. So what happens is your muffler gets hot, it heats up the spring in here which moves this to that position which turns off the choke. So that's what that's supposed to look like. It's supposed to go in between this little plastic piece here. You see that? And that's what that is supposed to look like. 